welcome in. Just setting up a light. Ohio, how are you? So we're just scanning around. I'm gonna go through the new table first. Just give me one second. All right, so here's the new table with the inventory. So you have an oil can, this little brass pail, glass oil lamp, some tobacco tins. So if you guys see anything here that catches your eye, just let me know. This amber decanter we have for 15. That is a glow piece and I do have a little matching bowl upstairs. The pear also glows. Some Murano candies. But, welcome in guys. We're just gonna start running stuff here in a minute. Some little pill boxes, the door knockers, the turtle. Is that pennant in the middle? This is not a pennant. Um, or it might be. Has the hook right there. I know this is just a brutalist piece, I believe. No, this one isn't the signed one. So this one we have for 125. We are always open to offers. Um, but I do have two other pieces that kind of match this. This is the Brutalist uh, ring. And then this is like a, a cuff. And that one's signed. So let me know. I'm going to put this down for a second. I didn't see the ring. Yep, give me one second, I'll show you that. All right, so the ring is right here. Let me get you under the ring light. And then, yeah, Queen, if you wanna take it, uh, you know, a couple pieces. I'll definitely work bulk with you. Make sure I offset that shipping. What is it? Let me just put it on. So, that is the ring. Welcome in, guys. If you guys have any questions, just give me a shout. Are they people? I don't think so. I honestly... I don't know. I don't think. Hey, Kettle. Good morning. Now you have me staring at it up close. Yeah, no, it's definitely a unique piece. So we had these three kind of together. So one, two, and three. That one is signed by the artist. So that one I have alone at $3.95. So that one I could do separate. But if you were interested in these two originally, let me know and I'll give you my best price. Morning, morning, everyone. If you're looking for unique, we definitely have um, a lot of cool items. Like, I've just made lots of people say, oh, I want something I've never seen before. Give me two minutes, you know. Um, so definitely a lot of cool stuff. If you like that, I also have the vintage earrings here. 
I think these little pill boxes are so stinking cute. Uh, yeah, I have a whole ring lot, actually. We don't do jewelry. Hey, Captain, how are you? I am the least delicate person, so we do not do jewelry. So we were trying to sell this as a lot just so that it's gone. Where is it? And well, when I have this brooch, I'm doing well. Here's the back. Here it is. So I have this little brooch. But I also have, this is a set of 12, these little clips. Yeah, welcome in, guys. If you have any requests, let me know. Um, but I have this whole, it, this is all costume jewelry rings. So. Do I have for candles? Other pieces of jewelry. I have candlestick holders. I have a whole lot of the clothes. The clips. Okay. So you're asking if you want to bundle the clips? I'll lay them out. It's a set of 12. Um, All right, and then did you want me to run the other stuff? The clips are candle. Oh, for like a wick? Oh no, you put a candle in here? Well, we have it labeled as set of 12 German Victorian tree clips. Christmas tree. All right, welcome in, everyone. Guys, I have these a uh, couple pieces here. What is there, eight, I think? Six, seven, eight. So we're doing a you pick on these. This is a you pick. You pick. $8 start on any of these pieces. Make the quantity eight. Add listing. Pin it and run it. All right, so this is running. You pick any of these vases, $8. Kettles winning vase one. Yes, candles on Christmas tree. Oh. See, I didn't know that. I actually just found out this year. Um, Kettle, you could also let me know which one. And if you were interested in all the rest... I could do each of them for six if you take them all. So, Kettle, thank you, thank you. Let me know. I just found out this year that, um, like, when you go to get a Christmas tree, that they shake them because of the spiders. Is the one on the left orange? Yes. So, the only thing with this one is, obviously, that sticker kind of got... But... I think we put the other half of the sticker in here. So the other half is there if you wanted to try to tape it. Um, but let me just show you the condition and everything on this one. Yep, cool. You are all set. Oh, wait, I remember why mom said to keep a pen. Which I don't think I have because we have the tags. I could just write kettle. Well, I'm going to take a screenshot. How about that? All right. Well, sorry, Mom. Forgot the pen. All right. So, kettle, you were all set. Thank you. Thank you. Spiders mostly stay. Oh, my God. Get the squirrels out. We have had, I won't lie, we do a fake tree these past couple years. Um, in the past, we always did a real tree, but it just, we had two huge dogs and they would always bump into it 
And when they bump into it, it was just like waiting, waiting, waiting for the thing to fall down. The ornaments to break. These do not glow. However, I have pieces upstairs that glow. Um, I have the pear that glows. I have the new bowl that glows. If you guys want to see uranium, just let me know. I'll get the black light. We'll show that. And the orange one. This one? This one is like pinkish, but it has that tint of orange. <laughs> Howdy, I have not. I've been very good. This one, no. Trust me, I thought it was a glow one, but it does not glow. I could show you guys. I have these two pieces that are brand new that do glow. I know, trust me, it was a heartbreaker. But then that pair, that pair I didn't expect to glow, but I tested it and it glows. Give me one second, guys. I'll show you. Get the black light. All right, let's see how this looks on camera with uh, just the main light off. Oh, you could tell. So, pear is glowy. This one glows. I don't think anything else glows. No, no to the frog. Hey, Spam. So, just these two for the glow in here. Um, but like I said, I do have that glow closet upstairs if someone wanted to see, um, you know, the other pieces that glow. All right, so welcome in, guys. Spam, I don't know if you would actually like these. These are little pill boxes, so... Let me know if you have any interest in these. This one's an apple. I collect, welcome in. I have two new pieces I can show you. Miss El Hanko, how are you? So this is another little pill box. This is a, um, what do you call these, hinge backs? Or it has the spring. Good, good. Yeah, so these two are very, very cute, very little. So I have that one at 25 and this one at 25. So if you are interested in the two, I could do two for 40. So I'll knock that 10 off. And then I collect black memorabilia. I have these two new pieces in. Welcome in, guys. K.A. Baker, how are you? New little oil lamp over here. So, I'm going to just start running stuff. Hello, hello. What is the one in the middle of the star with the stone? This is a Brutalist piece. No new compacts, just the one I showed you the other day. So, Kettle, this is, I guess, a pennant for a necklace. Uh, this I have at 125 However, I do have these other pieces that kind of go along with it if you want to bundle. I have this ring. And then this is a cuff, but it's signed by the artist. So that one I have up, priced up. But again, we'll always work with you guys. Little frames? Yeah, right here. Oops. Any cameras? Uh, One camera, not tested. I could show you if you're interested. I'd run it for five bucks. 
So I have that for 18. These two for 18. But yeah, kettle, again, if you always want a bundle, I'll work with you. Show you the backs. Yeah. 18 each. You want me to give you my price with the star and those? So 125 plus. So for the star, for the two picture frames and the stars, it comes out to 161. Um, if you are interested, I could do 120. Pass on the star. Okay. For the two picture frames, I could do two for 30. All right, guys, welcome in. We're just scanning. I'm going to just start running some stuff in a moment. I'm going to do these candy soon. Um, Bluegrass, Paula, are you guys still in here? Give me a shout. Yeah, I could do that. Let me run it right now. Oh, let me put that here. All right, we're going to call this two frames. Two frames, two six. All right. So, Kettle, I have these up and running. Welcome in, guys. If you guys have any requests, let me know. I'm just going to uh, kind of start running stuff here. But if anyone was interested in the pictures in the back, let me know. We could work something out. I have some beer trays left. Some milk. So let me know. Lots of glass, too. All right. Kettle, kettle. Thank you. Thank you. I'm going to set that down over here. So thank you. Thank you. All right. Guys, I had this doll for 10. If someone wants her for 8, I think she's a little creepy. All right. So that's that. What about this? I ran this the other day. That's why it's here. Let's run the seagull. Seagull, candle, stick, holder. All right, so I'm going to run it for $8. This guy is up and running. Welcome in, guys. If you guys have any requests, just give me a shout. We got the e uh not the eagle. Um the seagull candle scones up and running. But let me know what you guys would rather see. Brass, glass. I got street signs, patches, so a bunch of stuff. All right, let me make my way over here. These are all made of iron. So one, two, three pieces. If anyone was interested, I'm gonna run a paperweight. I'm gonna run, or I'll do the Murano candies. Murano candies. We have it for 28. I'll run it for 25. Give you guys a little leeway. All right. These are up and running for 25. 
Welcome in, welcome in. If you guys have any requests, just let me know. Kay Bailey, how are you? Welcome in. All right, so we are scanning around. After this, I'm gonna just start running and running and running. All right, so let's do, ooh, let me tag in. Let's be on the little flower paperweight. Are we talking about this one, El Hinko? Or this guy? Yes, okay, and I also have a red little flower upstairs. Uh, just because this is Milfenori, it has the polished bottom. I have this one for 55. We are always open to offers, but I do have that red one upstairs if you want me to grab that. Give me one second, guys. Be right back. Give me one sec. I'm not grabbing that paperweight yet. The frog. All right, so the frog is a little tea light holder. Welcome in, everyone. Um, I have the frog at 16. However, Kay Bailey, I could give you a steal if you were interested in this as well. I have that for 45. I would do the two for 30. So if that interests you, let me know, and I'll run the set. Pass. But yeah, El Hinko, let me know. Um, like I said, I do have the one single flower one upstairs. I'm going to tag Zach Zales. Show him one thing. Yeah, no worries. Let's keep running. Okay, so nesting dolls over here. This holds matches and then it's an ashtray. The tiny trinkets, those are awesome. Uh, I have them for 25 each. I said if someone took both of them, I'd do two for 40. So I'd knock $5 off of each. So these are, this is one. This is like a little pillbox. All right, so this is the apple. And then this is the the hinged uh, trinket box. Or same thing, pill box. All right, so let me know if you're interested. Okay. All right, guys. So let's see what we could run. I'm going to run the little shoe ashtray. Or we have it for eight. I'm going to run it for five. Shoe. Oop. Nope. Shoe ashtray. All right, so I have this up and running. The green planter, of course, I'll show that next. I also have a little elf planter I could show. So this is up and running for five. I got a bunch of brass planters, a huge long one that's perfect for spring. Um, I made planter lots the other day. I thought that was funny. Guess people are getting ready a garden. So I have this one for eight. Um, but there is another little one that I want to show you. So first, let me know on this one. All right. 
So then where's the log? Okay. Welcome in everyone. And then Jess, this is the other one, the elf. So I'm gonna run the green planter first. Green planter. I don't know if you guys could hear the wind is like ripping right now by my house. All right, so this is up and running for eight. So Jess is winning at eight. And then Jess, did you like the elf one? Get you a number on that. And I'll discount it since you bought this. You have this running with eight seconds left. Here's the bottom. No chips on the top. All right, so Jess, thank you, thank you. I hit the gong for you. So you are all set. Um, this is that elf one. So it's a little elf on a log. So like I said, let me know if you're interested. We have this one at 18. Um, I could do... I could do 12 if since you bought the other one. So I'm going to make the listing for this. Welcome in, everyone. Elf Planter. Pinning, and this is up and running. But welcome in, guys. We got this little planter up and running. No chips or damages on him. El Hinko likes a little elf. He's a little cutie. Trish, welcome in. All right. So we have El Hinko winning the elf at $12. So El Hinko, thank you, thank you. All right, while I'm right here, I'm going to run the U-Pick again. So any of these are U-Pick $8. And if you are interested in multiple, just let me know, and I'll give you a bulk deal. I'm trying to make some room in this light box. So $8 U-Pick on any of these. At 12 seconds left. Welcome in, guys. All right. Does anyone know if we're allowed to sell lighters on whatnot? Or is that still a rule that we can't? All right, guys. I'm going to run the Snoopy Bank. I also have Betty Bop. And I'll do half off on this. I have it at 12. I'll run it for six. This is just a pin. Um, but this is a 1966 Snoopy Bank. All right. So we're going to run him. I have him for 18. Again, we'll go 18 to 12. You guys like that? Snoopy. Not Snipey. Snoopy. Bank. All right, welcome in, guys. This is up and running. Little Snoopy Bank. And like I said, if anyone is interested in any items or you look for something in particular, just give me a shout. All right, after the Snoopy, I'm going to run the Betty Bop. For six. All right. Hey, morning, morning. All right. 
All right, guys. So we have the Betty Bob pen. Hello. Oh, there we go. Okay. So this is the pin back, just to show that it does work. My fingers are just too big, and then it shuts. All right, so we're gonna run the Betty Bob. I said six. Uh, just do it for three. Get it gone. Betty Bob. Is it Betty Bob or Betty Boop? I really, I really don't know. That's not like a joke. Betty Boop. Oh, well, it's running as a Betty Bop, but it's Betty Boop. So this whole time I was saying Betty Boop and no one wanted to say, hey, Keely, you sound like a lunatic. It's Betty. What was I saying? Betty Bop? I don't know. Someone needs to take her home now. Give Betty Boop a better home. All right, so she has five seconds left. Oh, gosh. See, because it's innocent mistakes. Like, when I first started this, um, what was one I said? And I'm 20. It's not adorable. Like, I should know how to speak. But I, uh, what did I say? Oh. Instead of um, dolphin, I was adding an A. I was like, Dala Finn. And people must have thought I just had a wicked Jersey accent, but who knows? Yeah, exactly. 1920 is I was born in 03. Got this little paperweight. If anyone's interested. It's funny, too, because a lot of people, when they go to my age, the first thing they'll say is, Oh my God, you're so young. You weren't even alive during like 9 11. And I was like, yeah, no, it like first generation that wasn't, you know, here for any of that, which is kind of crazy to think about. Right? All right, so I'm just fixing this. All right, so those are the Murano candies. I have that whole lot, six of them for 28. Let's make our way over here. So some brass, ash trees. This is the Eagle cast iron plate. Some sconces, some ducks. So let me know if any of this catches anyone's eye. This is another brass planter over here. So this one we have for 25, this basket. Got the crocodile up here, some little trinkets. Let's flip the light. Over here. <laughs> I guess so, El Hanko. Let me run this guy. Guys, or I'm not, I'm sorry. I called you El Hinkle. I meant to say kettle. Jeez. Well, for those who know my mom on here, mom, I don't know if she says her age on here. Let me make this bear listing. We have this one for 30. I've had it for so long. I'm just running it for 15. I'm giving literally half off. I'll show the tag. We had this as number 15, 30. This is up and running. But yeah, mom was born in uh, 1980. Yeah, she's an 80s child. Oh my god. <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh god. A little dark humor today. 
pass on that. No, we would not sell mom. Kettle said I was 81. What else can I run here? I keep grabbing this creepo. I think just the Lily said she collected teapot. 85, there you go. I'm 03. Got this little teapot here. Let's see. What about this piece of milk? I'll take the tree clips. Uh, how much for the teapot? I graduated in 04. Yeah, I was one. <laughs> so, uh, if you're referring to the teapot, yes. Uh, I have the teapot listed for 225. I'm always open to offers. If you are interested in taking it home right now, I do a one-time deal. I could do 180. So 225 to 180, that's the absolute best I will do. Um, so if you are interested, let me know and I'll run that. Then this is a little milk glass bowl. No. Stop. So, uh, Liz, let me know. Like I said, yeah, definitely. I'll, um, be live at least until 9, 9.15, so... Definitely let me know, and I'll run it. Milk bowl. Oops. All right, guys, so I have this milk bowl up and running. <laughs> I guess you could be. So this is up and running for 12 Move this in so you guys could see. Welcome in, guys. Should I rerun this one for eight? Should I be nicer? If someone says I'll take it at eight, I'll rerun it. Just because I have these clips here I took out. Crazy cat lady. I have some crazy cats if you're interested. Some cat items. I'm going to do this little tree bell. Absolutely right up there. Wait. Right. Oh my god. Right up here. Yes. Uh, Yeah. I would do that one. I don't know if that's real. Hang on. See, you're making me touch weird things in the morning. It's, oh my God, I thought it was fake. It's definitely real. I didn't, it's not hollow either. Like it's definitely he heavier. It does have this so you can hang it. Here's my beautiful cow. Mm. I guess. Yeah, I don't know. Because, like, the teeth look real. Hang on. Let me put this down for you guys to see better. Because, oh, all right. All right, so... You let me know. Um, that's what I think. I'd say lick it. Oh my God. Well, I still don't think I would give it a nice lick. It's just... It's not weird, It's because I find it somewhat cool, right? But, like, when I look at these grooves of the teeth, I'm like, 
Look at how big that tooth is. Like, could... Oh, he got a wolf's tooth. All right, let me show the front. I just don't want to, like, hold it the wrong way and break it. See how the teeth look like separate parts when it's on TV tells her. Hmm. Anyone want my moo cow? We'll show his eyeballs. And how does one eyeball fit through there? Come on. I could fit a baseball. You're telling me a cow's eyes as big as a baseball? Oh. How much? Um. So I have it for 60, but I don't know if I'm allowed to sell it on whatnot. People have told me in the past that it kind of bends the rules. Um. I think if I just do a different name in the listing, like I call it our friend cow, it should be okay. Um, but yeah, I'd have it at 60 if you were interested. I saw that. Yeah, shoot me a private message. I guess, I mean. Hey, Thin Red, how are you? Paint an artifact. I don't think it would break. Let me see what mom thinks. Yeah? Then, tell you what. Shoot me a message. I'm going to say, tell me. All right, so shoot me a message if you're interested, and we'll uh, we'll continue our little cow. I'm going to put him on the side for you over here. Oh, wait, he's a little heavy. I'll put him over here. Right. Yeah, I might next week, depending on how much I spend on how much. Okay. No, you let me know. Just shoot me a message so I have uh, your name at least saved. I do have, I'm trying to think, I don't really have other skull items, but I have animals. Yeah, thank you, thank you. I appreciate that. 25 people in, holy smokes. All right, guys, let's run the chicken. I'm just going to start running some stuff. All right, so we have the chicken. We have them for 18. I know we have a couple of friends in here, so we're going to run them for 12. This is up and running. Wait, that figurine, is he a man fig? The mask? Welcome in, guys. This is up and running for 12. Is he... Oh, the blue guy? This one? My little buddy? Doesn't he have the big neck? Yeah. You want him? Little tall guy. Says, uh, Metallic Inc., uh, 1983, Mexico. And then it has another. I mean, oh, he moves every time. I mean, I'd run for three bucks. If you like him, I'll give you a good deal. Oh, that's awesome. Here, let me run him for three. Cool. All right, so we have this up and running for $3. What's so funny is I had this under some stuff the other day, and I was like, he doesn't belong in this bin, so I just put him out, and I forgot. I misplaced them clearly on that shelf. But at least you, uh, you spotted him. 
Yeah, Holly, it's a good deal for sure. We like to do steals and deals. So you guys shout it out and we'll go from there. Now, does anyone know if lighters are still banned on whatnot? There you go. So thank you, thank you. First purchase for one, so you are all set. We'll hit the gong for you. Okay, they are. See, I have a, some really cool ones too. Okay. So, back to over here. Texas Heat, welcome in. These are some of the new items, some decanter tops, um, glass, paperweights, stuff like that. So if we see anything here, let me know. I'm going to step out and grab my sweatshirt. These I can get in trouble for? Or lighters. The glass candies? Yeah, the Murano candy is a set of six. I have them for 28. Um, I ran them for 25, though. Ooh. Jeez, it was a little chilly. The lighters. Got it. Uh, yes, it is. See, for a vape on that's crazy. All right, so I have these Murano candies up and running. And then, Lori, I could show the large pendant. Pendant. Am I saying pendant? So, Liz is winning the Murano candies, all six. Um, I do have a signed horse piece. I have it up for $250. I'm always open to offers. Um... Knife, knives I can't sell and whatnot. Fishing items? Shoot me a message. Hunting? Maybe. My brother lives in Florida and he's always selling stuff, so. Liz, thank you, thank you for your purchase. We're going to go hit the gong. Shoot me a message and I'll double check everything. So, Liz, I'm going to hit the gong for you. We're going to move these very carefully. But these are some cool color ones for sure. All right. Give me one second. I'm tiptoeing. All right, and then I'm going to show the pendant. All right. So, Liz, thank you, thank you for your purchase. You are all set. All right. And guys, if we are interested in glass, I do have a glass room. We have enough friends in here. I could do one dollar starts. So let me know. Um, and then Mick Coral, let me know if you're still in here. Okay. Yeah. No. 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 I'll just clear everything uh, with Mom after she gets home from her day job. And uh, who knows? Maybe we'll go live tonight. But yeah, definitely give us a follow. Bookmark my shows. Um, we're trying to find what time slot works best for us. So. I know my shows say 11, but we are messing around with the times this week, so just stay tuned for that. So again, I have this one at 125. I am always open to offers. I do have a couple other Brutalist piece, pieces, like the ring, and then that's a signed cuff by the artist. Okay, so let me know on that if we were interested. Um, more glass, if we want to see that, just give me a shout. I'll go upstairs. As for horse, I have this one decanter up here. Hey, we picked, how are you? So I have that horse decanter, so let me know. Yeah, Liz, I have a couple paperweights in the room. Uh, I have two more upstairs. I have two down here, or two or three, so I could show you that after I show Coral the horses. So I have that horse decanter up here. What is this? This is a, just a statue. All right. And then the last one that is really cool. If 
by our Mr. Cow Skull, which I'm gonna move him to a proper place now. Is this horse piece over here. And this one is the 250 piece that's signed by the artist. So this is like a wall plaque. All right, so let me know. Liz, I will show you some of these paperweights. No, my little pony. Uh, I will double check the name in one moment. So Liz, let me know if we like any of these and I'll give you my best price on the paperweights in the room. And then I do have other ones upstairs that I could also work with you on. This pair is uranium. The pair does glow. So I could show you it with the black light. Little Mil Milfinori piece with the polished bottom. All right. So Liz, let me know if you're interested in any of these. I'll let you look for a moment. That really cool oil lamp back there. So lots of cool stuff. Um, let me go get the artist for coral. Um, so from what I could see, plug. P L L U G L O eight. So let me know on this piece. Um, Liz, let me know on those paperweights. What's it made of? How much for the pair? The pair I have for $65. Um, I'm always open to offers. Like I said, that one really does glow nice with the black light. But the more you grab, the better the price. What is it made made from? Uh, this is brass. So still a really cool piece. And if you did like any of the other horse items, I would obviously work with you on the pricing. So I'll scan over the other ones. All right. So let me go over here. I'm gonna just start running some stuff. So let's do the oil lamp. Oil lamp. I have this one for 40. I'm gonna do it for 32. This was actually discontinued, so I stopped making these. Uh, yeah, actually, I just got one in literally yesterday. Welcome in, guys. If we have any questions, just give me a shout. Pass on that. All right, and then the old scales, so... I have, let me move it over here. So it is a little heavier. So, oy. I have this one for 65. All right. Hey, Just a Lily, how are you? Just a Lily, I don't know. I know you like that teapot. I said I was running a one time deal today um, at 180 for the teapot. Morning, morning. 
All right. Um, give me one second. I just want to get a weight on it because it is a little heavier. Be right back. Hang on, guys. Um, after I run this, I do have two or three other scales that I could show you. Hey, Starbright. If you want to bundle after this one. All right, so we're going to do... All right, so Mr. Cotton, this is running. Mr. Cotton Farmer is winning this. Huge, huge scale, so. Trying to show you more. All right, so we got five seconds left. All right. Mr. Cotton Farmer, thank you, thank you. I'm gonna move this. Hey, yesterday's welcome in. We, we are moving this down. Okay, so Cotton, let me know on these. Um, oh, the other one's gonna be in the other room. Unless it's behind me. I'd have to look. I do know I have another one, but let me know if this is something you would be interested in. Yes. Okay, so give me one second. I believe I have one more. Or I know I do. Um, hang on. I don't know if I have it hanging. And I will be right back in one minute. scale I think it's in a box out there um so I'm gonna run this one discounted and then when I find the other one I'll also discount it so this one we have at 85 I'm gonna run it for 50 for you so let me just get the listing New York scale Save. All right, so this is now running. So, Mr. Cotton Farmer, thank you, thank you. Obviously a bit rusty. There's patina on it. But I'm going to shoot you a follow, and then I'm going to message Scale. All right, so I just messaged you Scale, so I have it in my inbox to send you that message or of the photo when I get it. 
So, Mr. Cotton Farmer, thank you, thank you. Watch, I'm gonna be doing this show and like randomly halfway through I'm gonna find it. Yeah, of course. Um, teapot. I know just a lily, but there's someone else. Um, Coral, are you still in here? Lori, are you still in here? And then, let's see. Uh, I think it was Liz. Was it Lizby who wanted it? All right, I'm gonna run the teapot. All right, guys, this is up and running. We have it originally at 255. Welcome in. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. How are you? And then let me see. Let me tag at Lisby. Okay. So I'm gonna run. Welcome in, guys. We were going through some stuff before. I'm going to do the doll now. And then I can get up and scan. Uh, we have the doll at 10. I'm literally running it for 5, so half off. So this is up and running. But welcome in. If we have any questions, just let me know. Um, I was going through glass, brass. Hey, Faza, good morning. Faza, I know we're mixing up our times, but I was just, we're trying to find what time slot works best for us. So that's why it's all chaos. Morning, morning. Guys, if you're not following the Faza, make sure to give him a follow. New seller here. Tricky. All right. Okay, I'll welcome back in. We're just running. I think this is a, what, a wolf? I think a shepherd. Right? That's a German shepherd. Someone's going to want him, the little shepherd. All right. So we're just showing some stuff, running, going from there. I'll tag Red Fork for the new paperweights. I'll tag Family and then JJ. Or let me tag Jay Ferris. Okay, so welcome in, guys. Some tobacco tins over here, paper weights, some glass, brass. This is a little clutch. If I could open it. I need two hands, probably. If anyone's interested in the purse, let me know. Little oil can. So let me make my way this way. And welcome in. What about the cast iron eagle? Cast iron. I know we have for 18. 
guys, I'm probably going to say, what the heck, later. But $10 on this. Cool piece, older piece. So this is up and running for $10. Need some space, so... Welcome in, guys. Got 10 seconds left on this. New Daily, how are you? All right. Hello, hello. All right, so let's see. I'm going to turn here. Okay. So, the chickens, the inkwells, some license plate. What about the wooden, uh, what is this, for milk bottles? Or is this for shoes? Oh, I think it's for shoes. Yeah, shoe shine box. Yeah, I could definitely show you that. Um, let me run this really quick while I have it out. It's big and bulky. I have it for $45. I'm going to just run it for $35. Give $10 off to offset the shipping. So shoe shine box. So $45 to $35. Break up that shipping. Welcome in, guys. This is up and running. So here's the plaque. All right. Welcome in. Pass on this. The railroad light. So this is Chicago. Maybe I shouldn't put it here. I'm gonna put it on the table. Um cotton and I'll discount it for you. You bought two bigger items today, which helps us dramatically with space. Okay, so up here, let me just show up here. It does open. I just would have to figure out how. So let me know if that's something you'd be interested in. I'd get a weight and run it. Yes. All right. So again, I had this one at 225. I could do 150 on it. Like I said, you've been buying a lot. We appreciate that. So I'd do 150 on it. All right. So let me just get a weight. Okay, so, give me one second, guys. Joe Love Pumpkin, welcome in. Give me two seconds, save this. Okay, so, this is... Oh, wait, hang on. I didn't name it. Hang on. Okay. So. Wait. 
All right, so this is up and running. Welcome in, guys. We got the railroad lamp up and running for 150. If we have any questions or requests, just let me know. Mr. Cotton Farmer is winning this awesome light. And I'm going to put this right outside of the room. Or I'll put it over there so it doesn't get hit. Yes. So, what was the shipping on your end? So, Mr. Cotton Farmer, thank you, thank you. You are all set. We're going to hit the gong. Because for items that are this heavy, I have to just do a custom weight. All right, guys. So welcome in. We are just scanning around, running some stuff. Was the shipping bad on your end? What state are you in? Fifteen's not bad. Oh, yeah, no, that's, we're in New Jersey, so that's pretty good. So this I have for 18 if anyone's interested. I've seen, like, to California, it's like 52, 75, so the 15 one, you must live close to me. Let's run the brass pail. Brass pail. This is cute just to keep outside. This is up and running. Um, Elvis, no. But I used to have a bunch of wind chimes. Um, right now, the only thing similar I have are like bells. So if you're interested in bells, let me know. All right, so we're just running through some stuff now. These huge swans, if anyone wants to really make some walk-in room, because these we trip all the time. And guess what? There's one, two friends, but don't be fooled. There's three and four, so four pals. Anyone interested in those, give me a shout. Some little signs over here, some vases. So let's run some stuff from over here. Um, what about this? This is the queen. All right, guys, so... Quite rusted. Hang on. So oh there we go. Let me get this in the light box and give it a run. So this is we'll call it the queen queen trinket. We have it at 25. Um, 25, I'll run it for 20. So, it's definitely older. Let me show the back. All right, so this is up and running. So, here's the bottom, and here's the top. Welcome in, everyone. We're just scanning, running some stuff. After this, I'm going to do rerun the Snoopy and the pictures. Okay. We're going to pass on those. All right, so let's rerun the Snoopy. Snoopy Bank. 
up and running for 12. This is 1966 bank. Welcome in. So if we have any requests for certain items, just let me know. All right. And then we're going to run the buyer's choice of a you pick. All of these are $8. So $8 on all the pictures. So you get to pick which one you want. $8 SB on all. All right. Pass on that. Let me just continue scanning. I got this huge oil lamp over here, old phone. It's nice little brass pieces down here. Let me show back here. Welcome in, crazy duck mom. Old fire extinguishers, some pieces up here. Um, as we make our way up, there's a lot of brass and copper pots. So if someone's looking for something for spring or summertime, for planting, definitely have some stuff here. These ladle, the mask. All right. What about the little duck cane? This is a cane head screw on. We'll call it brass cane eagle. Brass cane eagle. Have it for 20. I'm gonna run it for 12. Give you guys a big discount there. If you're a reseller, you can do well on these. So this is up and running. What was the lizard that was hanging? Uh, the lizard is just a piece I've had actually since day one. Um, so I have him for 25. He's made out of either soda or beer cans. It's just a little art piece. If you're interested in him, I'll run him for 15 just to give him a good little home. So Seven Bridges, you let me know. Hey, Anita, how are you? All right. So I'll run that lizard. I'll pass. Here, let me show you him up close. Oh, so 24, so beer can lizard. Make my way back here. Do you like lizards in general or like tropical animals? You tell me. Some new glass pieces in here. Gotcha. So frog holder, so some other items over here. Um, I have one camera, it is not tested. If you're interested, I'd literally run it for five bucks. So let me know on that. I'm going to run these pill boxes. I'm going to run two pill boxes. Like I said, I have them at 25 each. I'm going to run two for 40. They are really stinking cool. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, yes, I will show those plates next. So this is pill box one. 
And then this one is the hinge. All right, so two for 40 on those. Yeah, uh, Bandit, I will grab that camera soon. Buff, let me know on this. I also have a Civil War decanter. This is obviously it hangs up. So I have that and then I don't know if you could see back there Civil War decanter. Um, so I'm going to leave this propped up. And I'll let you kind of look at it while I go grab what I need. Do we trust this? All right, stay. Good. All right, be right back. Hang on. All right, so I found the camera. Um, it's not tested. Like I said, don't know anything really about cameras, so we'll run it to get the space. This is the camera. So let me know if you're interested. Um, the side here says model B, number two, a Browning camera manufactured by Kodak, New York, US patents. So I'm gonna give this a run. Uh, Buffster72, let me know on that plea. And that Civil War decanter as well. I'm going to do camera as is. I said I'd literally run it for five. All right, so this is up and running. Uh, the decanter I have for eight. And the plea I have for 30. If you were to do two together, I could do two for 30. So I'd give you the decanter for free. If you do not want the decanter, the best I'll do on the plate is 22. All right. So Bandit is winning this camera as is. So we're going to go hit the gong. I don't think I have any other cameras. So thank you, thank you. First purchase from us. I appreciate that. All right. Not old cameras, at least. So, yeah, no problem. So you're passing on both, correct? I'll tell you what. Just because I want the room, I'll do a $5 Civil War decanter. I'll do $5 on the one. In. All right, guys, so this is up and running. Civil War decanter, Jim Bean, obviously empty, up and running for five. And then we do have a bunch of decanters under the table as well. If people want to see those, just let me know. Got 10 seconds left on this listing. Pass on that. All right, give me one moment, guys. Welcome, welcome, guys. We're going to scan. Morning, morning. It's 
We're going to scan right here. Do I have a max shipping? Um, I don't think so. I didn't change anything in the settings, but like how I do it is if you want that item, I'll lower that price so it offsets the shipping. What's the starting bid? Um, I had that one at 40, but I did run it earlier. I did discount it. So I'm going to rerun it. I had it at 32. Does everything have a starting bid amount? Anything JFK related? Um, n n I don't think anything JFK. Is everything? Uh, yeah, everything has an SB, but... Again, we'll always work with you on pricing. So this is running. This was a discontinued item. Okay. So let me just shut my ringer because my phone keeps going. On the oil lamp, I don't think... Not that I'm seeing. I do have other oil. Oh, wait, here. Maybe on the metal. Can you see that? Heck, yeah, they do, Faza. So, guys, if you don't know, all the sales do go to a wiener dog that I'm saving up for. So let me know. This is an oil lamp, but I do have perfume bottles upstairs. And I do have a larger oil lamp too, if we're interested. Welcome in, welcome in. All right, guys, I'm going to step out for one moment. Yeah, I will show the glass room. I am going to leave the camera here. The oil lamp is right here. I will be right back. Faza, can you mod the chat for literally two seconds? Be right back, guys. Welcome in, guys. All right, so, sorry, I had to just do one thing. Please stand by. Uh, Kate will BRB. Kate is back. So, Josh, are you still in here? And then, Donna, are you still in here? So, Donna, yes. So, Donna, shoot me your best number on this. I, I'm at 32. Um, the absolute best I could do would be 30 on that. So let me know. I do have perfume bottles upstairs as well as a glass room. 
Um, if you guys would be interested in that, I can always make my way up. So I have an oil lamp here. I swear it's not hitting the top. So if we want that ran, let me know. And then I also have these just in for, these are oil, I think oil lamps, right? Yeah, they have to be. So Josh, let me know on the orange ones as well. The big one, I'm at 45. Um, if you take the orange ones with it, I can go down to 30. Let me pull out the bigger one just so that you can see. Um, I know this is a steal, but it's a big item. <coughs> Whoa, excuse me. And obviously, just before shipping, I would have to drain this oil. Um, so this is Eagle brand. It does work. Mom yelled at me for this, but I, if you're a buyer, you should know that the product works, right? So we're going to demonstrate. All right. Hang on. If this isn't a sales pitch, I don't know what is. All right, hang on. Working conditions. So, obviously, this just needs a little Windex to get cleaned up. Um, but, Josh, let me know. Does work. Oh, geez, it really does work. All right, all right, guys, all right. So if you want it to really burn, you put it up high. <sighs> All right. So Josh, let that be my demonstration that it does go. Um, so I am going to make the listing for it. So let me just make oil, or I'll call it larger, larger oil lamp. So I said 45. I'll do it for 40, meet you in the middle. All right, guys, so this is now up and running. Welcome in, welcome in. Maybe I'll start having that on if it doesn't sell during my shows. All right, so we're going to pass on that. Um, give me one second. I'm going to make my way over here. Where did I just put that little blue lamp? Um, can we see your paper weights? Of course. So here are some of the paper weights. I do have that I definitely know three more upstairs. So if you're interested in these, let me know. I could work with you in bulk. Um, but like I said, I do have more upstairs if you are interested. And then let me know if I should rerun that oil lamp. This pair is uranium, it does glow. Okay. So Mama Mo, let me know on these to start.
And then I could show you the uranium one uh, under a black light if you're interested. How about I run this basket? Nice little hobnail basket. So on all of them or just one? I'm gonna run the hobnail basket for 20. Amber basket. I'm gonna run this guy for 20, so this is running. You have a white hand. Oh, the white hand that's like this, Jess. Momo, Mo, I'll give you the price on each one, um, but just know that I'm always open to offers and deals. So, Jess, that's actually a piece that we're not selling. It's our hand display for, um, like, our rings and jewelry. So, that is not for sale. However, frequently, I do get brass hands. So, stay tuned for that. I get really cool ones, so... I could always let you know on those. Um, for each one, so this one I have at 55. This is signed at 35, 35. This is a glowy at 65, uh, 18 on the big one. So they're all different prices, but like I said, I'm always flexible. Let me just get the black light really quick um, so I could show you that hair. So, oh, crap, I forgot to put the light. Okay. So, did I miss anything? So, yeah, Mama Mo, let me just show you the glow on the pair. Okay. I mean, if you want to, if you feel comfortable on giving me the number that you want to spend, I can make you a lot. So that's the glow pair. And then this is a glow dish that I have. All right, I also have a matching little bowl to this one. So if we were interested uh, in the two, I definitely work with you. All right, should we scan the glass room? I feel like you guys might like it up there. Hang on. We're gonna make our way to the glass room. I'll do a scan for you guys up there um, since I haven't scanned it yet. Okay, so this is the glass room, guys. So, um, Mama Mo, I do have this paperweight here. And this one here, I could bundle for you. Um, so let me know. This one I have at 18. And this one I have at 25. I could do two for 32. So if that works, let me know. But yeah, I'll do a little scan in here. Show you guys what we have glass wise. And then if we have any requests, obviously I'll show you it close and we'll run it. Welcome in. So we're just scanning around. Welcome in guys. Make sure you guys follow if you're not already.
Oh, I also look, I have this little paper right here. So welcome in, lots of glass as you could tell. Um, I know we are asking about perfume bottles, so I do have a couple. I have this one, if we were interested. And then I have this one. So I'm gonna set up the camera here and I'm gonna show you the two perfume. Thank you, Faza. Guys, if you're not following Faza, make sure you follow him. So I have this one for 25. So this one definitely has its a uh, fair share of beating. And then this one I also have for 25. This is a Stuart crystal, lead crystal. So again, like I said with the other tw two 25 items, I could do two for 40. Um, so I'm going to run that. I'm going to get them on the scale. So they are under a pound. Or they are a pound, I should say. So let me make this. Two perfume bottles. Two bottles. So we'll do two for 40. All right, so these are up and running. Welcome in, everyone. Got these up and running. All right. So after this, I will do one little scan. Wood trading, how are you? Welcome in. So we're gonna run a little, little more. And we'll scan. Got this little vase, clearly Kyle wrote that. For those of you that don't know, Kyle is the younger brother, but I'll give him the credit. So we'll call this purple and gold vase. We're gonna do this one as a little steal and deal, have it for 15, running it for eight. So let's see, all right. So this is now pinned up and running. Guys, if you're not following Wood Trading, check him out for some awesome hyped shows. So this we had for 15, running it for $8, guys. Welcome in, welcome in. All right, pass on this. I'm gonna do a slow scan of the glass room. And if we don't have any requests up here, I will just make my way downstairs. Welcome in. Scanning around. And like I said, if we have any questions here, just give me a shout and I'm gonna make my way downstairs after the glass. But if you guys have, um, not already, make sure you check out our future shows, bookmark those, check us out. All right. So we have this little vase. Made in Israel. This 
This is a planter made in Germany. All right, so no requests in here. So we're gonna make our way downstairs back to the main room. All right, guys, so we are in the main selling room. Do a scan and just keep running. These iron plaques, some little decanters and paper rates over here. The vases, let's run the two vases, two brass vases. Two brass vases. Two for 12. And all right, guys, so these two are up and running for 12. If we have any interest, just give me a shout. All right, we got seven seconds left. Ryan from Rose Treasure Troves, welcome in. Early morning show. All right, so I'll continue to scan this new table and we'll just keep on running. How's it going? I've been on since eight. So strong, strong start. Coffee is wearing out. All right, so I'm gonna make my way. Sophie's Choice, welcome in, how are you? We're gonna scan and just start running. All right, so I had the shoe ashtray. This is up and running for five. All right. So if we have any questions, just let me know. We're gonna stay on till 10. Got about five seconds left on this. Last minute steals and deals, yeah. So let's see if we have anything over here. I'm gonna run the U pick again. So the U pick is any of these um, little pitchers for $8, so let me know. So these are now up and running. Welcome in, welcome in. Froggy, how are you? Froggy, I have two, uh, I have a new frog in that I would pair up with the statue. So I got this guy in. Nice little tea light. So let me know if you're interested in him. No chips or anything. I'm going to run the tobacco, so I'm going to run the tins, not tons, tins you pick. All right, and there's three. So this is a you pick on the three tins. So we're going to pin this and run it. So you pick any of these tins for 10. If you want all three, it's three for 25. So you pick on the tins. Call me crazy cat lady. Welcome in. I have two cat items. If you are interested in seeing, let me know. Welcome in.
Hi there, how are you? So I'll show these again. These are the tiny little pill boxes. This was a little cat knocker. I have a black cat bottle if we want to see that. That's just outside of the room. Take a step back and show this. And we'll scan. All right, guys, so if we have any requests, let me know. I'm going to run the hop, the amber basket again. So we had it at 22. I'm running it for 20. Do I have any kitchen canisters? Oh, I had a brass one um, that I sold last week. Um, I don't think I have any canisters, at least none with a lid. I have a lot of brass and copper like pots and stuff like that. Oh no, none of those. I have these huge ladles. Hang on, I'll show you. These copper ones. So let me know if that's something that you would like. Big pots up there, the pitchers. Thank you. I appreciate that. Inkwell. So lots of cool items, a lot of glass. Um, so if we have any interest in that, let me know. I had the oil lamp running before. I did a little test on it. This lion door knocker I'm going to run. We have it at 55. So made of brass it's a larger one so lion door knocker so 55 unique threads how are you have this up and running for 55 guys here's the back that part hits the door show you the back where it mounts Eagle Eyes, welcome in. Unique Threads, how are you? Make sure you guys are following and bookmarking our upcoming shows. Good morning from Colorado. So Colorado, it's only 7.53 by you? It's all, almost 10 by me. Mountain time, exactly. Have these if anyone's interested. And here's the other one. There you go. All right, so these two, uh, I have this for 25, 25 on each of these sets. Um, if someone wanted to do two of them, I'd do two for 40. If you wanted all three, I could do all three for 55. So three for 55, two for 40, or one for 25. Welcome in. Let's see, I'm gonna make my way back here. Let's see if there's anything to run. What about the eagle, uh, the cane? This is up and running. Had it for 20, last one. So, want it gone. We have it up and running for 12. Yeah, any requests, let us know. So that's the twist on. Welcome in, guys. If not, we are just going to get ready, prep, wrap it up, and I believe we are going to go live again tonight. So, if there are no requests at this point, um, we're going to get ready to wrap and raid, 
and we will see you guys next time. All right. So have a good rest of your day and we'll see you guys later tonight. Bye guys.